Welcome to our channel. In this video, we are going to talk about Lucid Air vs Tesla Model S so before starting, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Lucid Air vs Tesla Model S Tech Features Lucid Air We'll certainly learn a lot more about the Lucid Air's interior tech when it debuts on September 9th, but for now, let's work with what we have. The cabin of the Air has several screens. Touch screens on both sides of the fully digital instrument cluster are two of them, which are not touchscreen. At the start of the central console, there's also an iPad-like touchscreen. It may be retracted to reveal a little storage compartment behind it. There will most likely be several USB or USB-C connectors throughout the inside. Apart from its powerful voice recognition system and a personal assistant feature, little has been said about the infotainment system. A facial recognition system can determine who gets into the automobile as the driver and alter the vehicle settings accordingly. Tesla Model S Tesla's Model S is recognized for its big 17-inch touchscreen in the middle, which is the largest in its class. It has a 12.3-inch digital instrument cluster. Although the infotainment system includes Bluetooth connectivity, it lacks Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and Amazon Alexa functionality. It does, however, include a navigation system with real-time traffic data and an internet browser. 11 speakers and an 8-inch subwoofer make up Tesla's music system. Three more speakers have been added to the improved system. There are two smartphone docking stations and four USB connections, no one else offers this. You can use a vehicle smartphone app for remote functionality, just like the Lucid Air and many other vehicles. Range of driving, charging, and power. Lucid Air. Lucid recently made news by claiming a 517-mile driving range for its forthcoming Air model. By a long way, that's more than any other mass-produced EV on the market. With a 113-kilowatt-hour battery, it was able to do so. The Air's charging time hasn't been revealed, but because of its 900-volt electrical architecture, we expect it to charge faster than any current mass-produced EV. With its dual motor configuration, Lucid claimed 1,000 horsepower when it launched the Air in 2016. That number hasn't changed, and it's possible it will when the production version is released. That's a lot of muscle, and it's more than most supercars have. There's more. A tri-motor model with 1,800 horsepower is in the pipeline. The forthcoming Air, according to Lucid, can reach 60 miles per hour in 2.5 seconds. Tesla Model S. The industry was impressed when Tesla recently announced an enhanced 402-mile driving range for its Model S Long Range Plus model, it was the first mass-produced EV to cross 400 miles. Lucid, on the other hand, stole the thunder with its 517-mile driving range. On a full charge, the Variant S Performance model has a range of 348 miles. A 100 kWh battery pack is used in both Model S variations. Because of Tesla's 400-volt electrical architecture, charging time will most likely be slower than the Lucid's. Expect a nearly empty battery to charge to 80% in around 30 minutes with an 11.5-KW onboard charger and a Tesla supercharger. A full charge from empty will take at least 6 hours with Tesla's Level 2 at home wall connector charger. We can only conjecture on power because Tesla curiously does not provide horsepower or torque data. Several third-party estimations, on the other hand, place the performance model's overall output at slightly around 800 horsepower. The performance variant takes 2.3 seconds to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour. Safety, driver assistance features, and semi-autonomous driving. Lucid Air. Because of its semi-autonomous Lucid Dream Drive system, we expect the Air to come with a large list of driver assist features. The Air, unlike the Model S, will contain a driver monitoring system as well as a litter sensor, short for light detection and ranging. The Air will be equipped with 32 sensors in addition to the litter sensor. Camera, radar, and ultrasonic sensors are among them. A surround view camera, blind spot monitoring, cross-traffic protection, traffic sign recognition, automated braking, adaptive cruise control, lane centering, headlamp help, traffic drive-off alarm, and a self-parking system are just a few of the driver support features available. We should find out if these sensors and functions will be standard or optional when it debuts. Tesla Model S. The Model S lacks the variety and number of sensors that the Air will have once it rolls off the assembly line, but it does boast one of the industry's best semi-autonomous drive systems. 
Under certain conditions, autopilot, a standard function, is a driver assist technology that can steer, accelerate, and brake for the driver. The full self-driving capability package, which is available as an option, is not a self-driving system. Despite its name, the Model S is not capable of self-driving. Drivers must still keep their hands on the wheel and pay close attention. However, when compared to other systems on the market, it is still a pretty advanced system. Navigate on Autopilot. A more advanced version of Autopilot, Automatic Lane Change, a self-parking system, the Smart Summon feature, and Traffic Signal and Stop Sign Help are all included in the package. So that's it for today. What do you think of our video? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and would like to hear more from us, please subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications before you go. Thank you so much for watching us.